So what's happening guys? Sonic Kai here again with another video and uh yeah, this is just a bit of a different video. You know, um I was just thinking since Sonic Frontiers is just less than 2 weeks away, you know, I thought maybe I would give my final thoughts of the game pre-release because everyone knows me, so my opinions are obviously valid. Yeah, I don't know. It was a it was a crazy ride. When you think about it, you know, when the start, when the game first came, uh, not came out, um, <laughs> was, uh, shown off, like, at the IGN first, like, the gameplay was just so terrible, nobody liked it, everyone was making just stupid jokes about it, but then, like, as time went on, like, the game started to look better, like, it really started to improve. And, I don't know, it's weird, it's like, I don't know, the, the marketing for this game has just been so weird. But honestly, with everything that's been shown, I think I can confidently say that I'm, I'm looking forward to this game. I don't know yet if it's gonna be like one of my favorite Sonic games ever, because like... <laughs> Quite frankly, it, it's it's still too easy. Like, the game is still too easy. But with everything that we've seen now, like with the uh, different combat, uh, the, the um, puzzles that have been leaked, a, a lot of the stuff that we've seen has been leaked. Like, a lot of it, most of the leaked stuff is really what sold the game, weirdly enough. The thing about this, this game is that it does look like there is a lot of, like, passion put into it. And, like, that's kind of part of the thing that I like about Sonic games from the past, like, early 2000s and everything. Even if the game was bad, if, if you could feel the passion in it, like, you can enjoy it. Like, this is why I like games like... 06 or <laughs> 06 because I saw the because I can you can still feel that there was passion put into the game even if the final product wasn't was less than ideal with Frontiers I do think it's going to be a solid game I don't know if it's going to be one of my favorites but we're weirdly enough it's funny because Frontiers seems to combine all the game the elements of games that i like and just put it into one like open world puzzles the um i shouldn't say unleashed but the boost stages and just platforming and and combat as well just funny looking back because like every 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 trailer we got it's it was like it started out bad and then just started escalating and escalating but then, like, even the people that were playing the game were saying that the game was good, too. So, like, everyone was just like, why are they hiding this, you know? Like, this is a good game. Why why hide it and everything? But I don't know. This was just a... This was, wasn't was scripted at all. I just wanted to give, like, my thoughts about, like, everything of, like, the marketing and everything. It probably sounds like absolute gibberish. But hopefully I was able to make some... Hopefully it was able to make some sense to people. And uh Yeah, we're just we're just gonna wait and see when the game comes out and hopefully we'll have a good time. And yes, I will be playing the game on the channel, so be sure to stay around for that. And hopefully we have have a good time. So see you in less than two weeks, I guess. <laughs>